Let's get it. All right, guys, today I'm going to be going into New York. They just passed a bill. Well, they didn't just, they're trying to pass a bill to crack down on Bitcoin mining. What does this mean for crypto? Okay, could this be another crash that could happen? Uh, I'm going to get into that. Also go over the market and see what is the best crypto coins right now that we're going to see do good in the next year, year and a half, or six months. Okay, let's get it. All right, guys, if you're new to the channel, my name is Rod the Water God. I give you up-to-date information on crypto and news that you need to know about, okay? So if you like hearing news that you definitely need to know about, make sure you subscribe to the channel, all right? So, guys, this is a bill that they're trying to pass to cut down any Bitcoin mining that's run on a carbon-based power sources. Now, we know that New York is trying to do some things with homes and with the CO2 in the air and the fossil fuels. They're trying to change the structure of homes so they won't leave a carbon footprint. All right. So here, guys, uh, the measure now heads to the desk of Governor Kathy Hosha, who could sign it into law or veto it. All right. If it is passed, it will make New York the first state in the country to ban blockchain technology infrastructure. So. We seen China do this, okay? And, you know, they banned the Bitcoin mining operations. New York is the closest thing to China, all right? So I'm not meaning the closest state, but I'm meaning as far as how they operate, okay? It's closer to China than any state. I'm not surprised, um, but what I am, I don't know what this is going to do to the market, okay? Um, when we seen Bitcoin, when it gets, uh, banned in China, we seen drops, but then we seen it push up a little bit. We've been, I think we're in a bear market. I think that, you know, we're in the bottom or close to the bottom right now with the market. So I personally don't think we can, we're not going to go down too much further, but anything could happen in this market. We don't know what's going to happen. So we just got to prepare for the worst, okay? And hope for the best. But the crypto market and stocks, I mean, dollar cost averaging in when you know it's a bottom is probably the best thing you can do for the future, okay? We know that the market is not going to stay down for too long. It's not going to stay up for too long. Well, it could stay down for a little longer. I mean, for a significant amount of time, but it's not going to stay down forever it's not going to stay up forever so this shall pass and we shall we shall see you know crypto do a lot better in the coming end of the year in the beginning of next year uh, now guys this isn't financial advice this is just my opinion on what i think about the market but i definitely see us you know bouncing back and doing some things in crypto all right so let me know you guys' thoughts. What do you think this crackdown is going to do to the industry? All right. Do you think this is a good time to start uh, investing in Bitcoin? Is Bitcoin mining dead? Do you think Bitcoin mining is dead? Or do you think, you know, everything is normal. This is just news that we don't even need to worry about. All right. So let's get into the market, guys. We see Bitcoin's at 29.7. So it has been stationary around 28 to 31 thousand dollars and that's very interesting because it lets me understand that when it dropped in 2020 it was at three thousand dollars and climbed back up we got up to you know 69 thousand dropped down to 28 27 we're at 29 now i think there's nowhere to go but up i think we're gonna be hovering around these prices now, we could go down a little bit more, but I think we're very close to the bottom. And I think that uh, this is a good time to be dollar cost averaging in. Not too heavy because, you know, these it's kind of spooky in the market right now with the stocks and crypto. But definitely, uh, it's, stand, it's, it's actually staying stationary. It's not really moving too far down. Bitcoin, I think, has performed the, the best in this uh, bear market with stocks and crypto, okay? 
Elon Musk put out some news that he'll be um, letting go some of his Tesla Tesla staff, okay, because he thinks the market is going to, uh, he's basically saying he's scared of the market. And I think this can cause further problems with other people panicking and saying, hey, you know, Elon Musk may be right. But this may be an opportunity for Elon Musk to just cut some of his staff, you know, cut the slack on people that he don't really have to pay, you know. You know, he's tight on his funds, so that could be the case, all right. So we see Ethereum at 1,700, all right. Uh, what is the top performer in the, we now have too many top performers in the last 24 hours, but Solano has been taking a beating this past couple of weeks, and I think it's something good to get into, to be honest with you. I think Solano is something good to dollar cost average in. I think the whole crypto market is going to, uh, revive, you know, we have more millionaires in the U.S. than ever. And it's easy to make a million. We're living in a time where it's the easiest to make a million. Okay. So that's how I'm feeling about the market. Um, and I, I think stocks will do well as well. You know, I think um, I got into a, a shipping, a transportation stock last week and i think the transportation industry and the stock market i think is going to do well i've been looking at the stats and uh they've been doing well with transportation because we need more transportation we're having it seems like the transportation isn't going anywhere all right the transportation and stocks isn't going anywhere so i feel like this is a good industry that you could dollar cost average in and there's a lot of good industries right now that you know, don't let everything scare you. Like, oh, man, it's just the whole market. Some companies that's doing good. Just like we've seen with COVID, we've seen some companies uh, do well because of the shutdowns and everything like that. So I think we'll have the same thing with this recession. And But i like to know you guys' comments. Let me know what you think. Let me know what coins, what stocks, okay, that you feel that would... Uh, that's going to perform well in this bear market, all right? And, guys, that's it for this video. Um, i catch you guys on the next one. Don't forget to invest smart and always take profits. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.